You make it sound so good on the microphone, like eating and drinking. <laughs> You're just like. <sighs> yeah, if you seriously, it makes you want to. It's like, oh, I want that celery. Mm. 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 Okay. okay, you're nasty. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's do this. Welcome, everybody, to our fabulous weekly episode of Tastefully Inappropriate. I am Katie Allen. And I'm Chris Cagle. And um, today, we have wings mm. to snack on. Katie, why don't you tell us like where the wings are from, the flavors? For sure. I am a bartender, as I think I've told you guys. Um, I work at Smokey O'Grady's, which is in East Lime. And we thought as our, perfect, yes, as our finger food for today, we were like, let's have wings. Because mm. they're literally the best wings in the area. I can attest to that. Yeah, they really are. Um, we did dry rubs today because, I mean, now we're just going to say who doesn't love a dry rub, but that sounds awful. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Put some spit on that. <laughs> But we did dry rubs to try to be a little cleaner. Mm, so we did good. garlic pepper parm, um, Jamaican jerk, and Raging Cajun. Oh my God, the Raging Cajun, I think this is what I'm eating right now. Let me see. Bomb. It's so good. So good. I want to eat one too, but I don't want to do it on camera because I don't think it's going to be pretty. Are you going to suck the bone, like the meat off the bone? <laughs> You know Wait, how I eat chicken, Katie. Are you like I know there's nothing left. Nothing Literally left. Don't eat mouth. your chicken wings around me if you're just gonna like nibble around like, them. Because I'm you, gonna say like, something to you, Ash. Look at it. Right, Coco? <laughs> mm -hmm. I you got don't in her even, ass like, last You know week. that nasty purple vein that's in them? Mm, you eat that too? Yeah. Eat the whole thing. Listen. <laughs> yes, you do. <laughs> there's like there's cartilage and like good stuff for your skin and like uh -uh. collagen. Car collagen, yeah. Collagen mm -hmm. or co mm, these wings are so good though. I'm not gonna sit here and eat these wings, um, but let us know if you want us to feature your food on our show. We'd love to taste it and tell you what we think. I definitely recommend Smokey O'Grady's wings. Yeah, go absolutely. down, go see Katie, grab a drink from her, order some wings, um, get the Cajun. Definitely try. There's these. like 50 flavors, so mm -hmm. you don't. I mean, if you like sauce, like I do, I'm a sauce freak. Needs to be on everything and extra of everything, so. If you want a sauce, don't worry. We have tons with it. But thank you again to Smokey O'Grady's for sending us these wings. Thank you, Smokey O'Grady's. I'm going to eat la, these la, la, later. La, la, la. They can just kind of sit here, though, I guess, right? We'll stare at them. They're pretty. You might pick that up. I might. I'm going to have a carrot. So, Chris, tell me about your weekend. I know. I feel really <laughs> <laughs> I, We're already I wanted, there. I wanted to ask you because I didn't want you to ask me. Hmm. Let me finish my carrot and have a sip. So, because I have so much to say about it. So much to say. So my weekend was pretty tame. Okay. Until Sunday. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I don't even remember. What did I do? So Friday and Saturday. I don't even know. I don't even know what I did. Oh, I Friday, I went to this amazing Mexican restaurant in Old State Rock, which was amazing. Oh, you know what? I stayed I home and I cooked. Amazing. Amazing. I cooked for my amazing. aunt. Amazing. Yeah. Yeah, that's sweet. Um, you had a pretty rough weekend, too, with that. With what? Family stuff, too. Yes, I did. Um, rest in peace to my cousin, Timmy. Yes, I'm yeah. sorry for your loss. Thank you. Um, I'm sorry. Yeah, so it's been, it, was a, it was a pretty tame weekend. And then, um, you know, earlier in the week, I, I got a message from... Our friend who just celebrated her 40th birthday, Miss Van why we felt Kroenstein. Like, <laughs> <laughs> who's why we felt like shit last Tuesday. Yeah. We still feel like shit this Tuesday from her part mm. two of her 40th. I mean, if it, I feel like there's a lot to talk about on Sunday. Yeah, so there's, let's just jump in because I don't know. We have 50 shades of fucked up on Sunday. Yeah. But let's like start off with like the semantics of it. Like okay. we went to, and I'm going to, I'm going to talk about this place. Um, they can be mad about it or not. We, um, we had a brunch at the new Vuv Gondolas at Nordic Valley. 
Nordic Valley. I'm sorry, Nordic Village inside the Ocean House. Is what oh it's yeah, called. okay, Nordic Village. Um, these gondolas, really, really pretty place. Um, you know, the Ocean House, for those of you who know, who don't know, it is one of the only five-star restaurants in this area, like legitimately five-star memberships. It sits on a hill overlooking uh, the Watch water. Hill. Yeah, in Watch Hill. It's really, really pretty. Um, definitely have had some some nights there. So, <clears throat> so uh, another friend of ours booked one of the gondolas for a brunch, and we're like, yeah, you know, we got a car service and everything because, you know, we're responsible adults. Exactly. But mind you, you're in a real gondola and mm-hmm. they fit they fit two benches in there for mm-hmm. you to sit on mm-hmm. and a table yeah. in a real gondola. There's Coco, not, can you pull this gondola? Can you find a gondola and pull it up? There's not any room in a gondola to begin with when you're skiing or snowboarding. Right. But anyway, so go ahead. I cut you off. No, no, no. It's fine. Um, you know, the atmosphere was amazing. Yeah. Drinks were flowing. Coldest we're having a good time. Of the fucking mm-hmm. Year, <laughs> it was cold. However, it was a hurricane they, outside. They provide you with um, heated blankets all and heated blan- all heated blanket. <laughs> no heat. All heated blanket. Mm-hmm. And you're freezing. It was funny because we're all wrapped up in layers and layers. I'm gonna and send it to in you. In order to get my jacket off, you have to put, put your arm across the table and have your friend across the table pull it off. And it was just. It, but it was fun. We kept laughing about it in the beginning. The vouv was amazing. The, the vouv was amazing. The, the drinks, drinks were, were amazing. Great. However, I will then, say this. Then. Well, no. Before then, okay. I will say Ocean House. I love the atmosphere. I love what you're trying to do. But that food That's was, what yeah, was not it no. at all. I mean, no. they started off with the charcuterie board, which is fine. I expected which was that. Good. I yeah, th- that I was good. I thought it could have been better. It could have been better. But I thought it was good. It was. And the first drink was beautiful. Beautiful. It's so good that we ordered another one. Mm-hmm. I mean, it comes with complimentary drinks with every meal, but that no one pairings, was... Yeah, pairing. I'm sorry. There were pairings. <laughs> Again, I'm just like, it's good. <laughs> but, you know, it was well decorated. I like the little yeah. cranberries and the rosemary. Um, but then, it, you know, it's a fixed menu. Yeah. So you have your options of, like, fondue... And then, like, I don't even know what the other thing was. It was, like, a sausage and potato thing. Lots of potatoes. Lots of carbs. Yeah. But I was just like, where is the bacon? Oh, there it is. Um, yes, yeah, it's really that's, pretty. Yeah, that's pretty much yeah. what we, that's exactly what we were in. That's exactly what we were in. That, I think that might be the actual one that and we were beautiful. in. it's beautiful. It is beautiful. And you, you feel like you're in... In the Swiss Alps or yeah, something. Yeah, you really do. Yeah, and yeah. it's all German, or I guess, Swiss, um, Switzerland... What were the plates? The plate. Remember they had? Oh, you don't remember. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Girl. Forget it, forget it, forget it. Forget it. Um, but but yes. anyway, what I was saying was I would really like to see them step up their game when it comes to um, the choices of food. Like, like yeah. where were the eggs? There was no egg dish. There was so, no So the girl, bacon. the waitress was amazing. She comes over amazing. and she's like, listen, I want to um, recommend you get the fondue because it's just really fun for everybody to partake in. We're like, okay, cool. We'll take mm. your re- recommendation. So... She comes out with it, and it's the cheese was great, but they bring you a basket of bread and a, a basket of like you know when you go to the grocery store those tricolored potatoes, and that was our meal: potato, <laughs> whole potatoes, yeah. and bread in a bag. It like, and it was weird. It was a weird bag too. It was, it was like, like a, a Swiss bag? Army bag with like a like a, a Red Cross heart yeah. on it. It was like yeah, and we're all like, well, okay, it's cute, fine, but like. Mm-hmm. What do you, how many whole potatoes are you going to eat? Right. And, and, and trust me, and I get it. I get what they're doing there because like as much as I'm complaining about it now, like it was so carb filled and we were just like hungry and drinking. Like we got full and we ate, you know, so, but I'm just like. Oh, and then we did that shot at the very end. What the fuck was that? Oh, we did a shot. <laughs> they, we lost you by then I mean things were getting a little fuzzy by then Okay yeah. so that's a note for you If you have a three drink maximum Because then you just 
<laughs> Say what now? And then we lose you. <laughs> Listen, we had a driver, okay? Yeah. Um, but yeah, so I would like to see like an ex Benny on there, you know, just something a little bit more upscale than, yeah. you know, fondue. And I get it. Like it's a tight space. You can't have big plates in there, but trust me, there are ways to do it. Or maybe like put out a, uh, a family style kind of deal where there's eggs and bacon, just a little bit more variety than yeah. potatoes and bread and cheese. So funny story i'm getting my hair done today and she's like oh yeah we just had brunch at the ocean house i said oh my god we did too we had it in the gondolas and she's like oh we saw those we we're walking in and she's like but the guy told us that we had to have earlier reservations for it. it's under events blah blah blah." i'm like okay cool she, i said well what was your uh brunch she's like it was one of the best ones we've ever had we paid 65 dollars a person 65 dollars a person they paid they got unlimited mimosas a tower of oysters, little necks. Wait, where? At Ocean House. If we had eaten inside. Girl, see, I mean. And I'm like, we paid a thousand dollars. She put freeze, it out there to freeze and eat bread and potatoes. Yeah. And yeah. she paid sixty five dollars to have bottomless mimosas and fucking raw bar. What yeah. did we do wrong? Clearly everything. Clearly we were trying to be so extra. We yes. got that we got played. Yes. We got played a little bit. Yes. So um so, yeah. So yeah. Disappointed in the meal. Love the experience. Yeah. Um, love the drinks. You guys killed it with the drinks. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah. Um, but get some get some get some fucking eggs and bacon up in there, Neat. please. Yeah. yeah. You know, offer something a little bit more than potatoes and bread. So then. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh. There's more to this story, huh? So then we're leaving. And it's like, you know, we had had four drinks. Can I just tell you how great you looked, by the way? Thank you. Like, you know, we, me and you, we kind of just like, we're like, what are we doing? We don't get to get dressed up and do the damn thing. So, like, me and you were pretty on the same page. We yes. had all the black. And I know. I kind of like it with my, I had this crazy mm -hmm. rhinestone beanie on yeah. it was super cute thank I you get to, yeah and i get to wear my my military I jacket with the, with the black fur we so. need to find those pictures of the ocean like when we we're facing the ocean pictures. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. so anyway we're leaving the ocean house and it's like okay we've had four drinks and a shot like it's sunday mm -hmm. i have to work on monday well you do too everybody else does not so we're like we think we're gonna go home no, no, no. Why would we do that? We go, Boring. We go <laughs> to Perks and Corks, the home of the largest martini. The lethal poured. martini. It's like 10 ounces. I don't know how they get away with it, but they do. So I will say that's when things got really kind Bad. of... Bad. In every aspect. In every aspect. I actually... I, I don't really remember leaving there. Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. so we all get these hot and dirty martinis, which were to die for. Oh, they were delicious. But again, we had already had four drinks and a shot, and we each order our own 10-ounce martini. And it just got bad. Um, Coco, Coco was there. We, was. we did run into Coco. We did run into Coco. I Coco forgot. Showed up. Yeah. yeah. Were we all googly-eyed, Coco? or You guys were like... Hey, right back. You know, we were those people. No, no, no. It was uh, probably 30 minutes in when we were like, hey, Lisa needs a cigarette. Like, <laughs> oh, my God. I came. I forgot it. She was like, go ask him for a cigarette. I'm like, really? I forgot. Do you even smoke cigarettes? No, but Chrissy does. Uh-huh. Mm, oh, yeah. Right. I now right. remember. And she went over and gave her one. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. So yeah, so um, yeah, and then we left there, and thank God our driver was like, "I think you guys should go home." Mm -hmm. And he brought us home. Shout out to our driver; he was amazing. He was awesome. He yeah. was awesome. He, he had to put up with us. I, I hope we didn't do anything like crazy in the car ride home. So I don't really. I remember. can tell you that who you <clears throat> did you sit in the way back on the way home? I think you did because um, we had to pay him to vacuum up muffins. Because we, people got, <laughs> wait, did I eat? You guys let me eat muffins? All the muffins were almost gone, like all the scones and all that. Like everybody, I didn't eat. No, that was, was that like had to be Shandog and 
The Christian. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember eating. Muffins, I'm pretty sure so you did. I'm saying it didn't fucking happen. I remember eating pizza later that night. No, I'm. But sure. I don't remember eating no muffins. I'm yes, I had pizza. Sure I broke my damn diet. But um, I, I think that you have the same picture sent into Coco. But um, mm. I want to. I want to see Coco if you can pull that picture up because he was well. Look at this one. Please. I don't know how oh he God. ended up in this position. Which one are you showing? Okay, so. Here we go first. Look how good Chris was looking. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's how it started. It yeah. is. Like, so good. Oh, oh, your outfit you. was on point. Thank you, babe. It was Bye. yours. <clears throat> oh. I didn't bring outfits in mine. And then. Okay. Oh, and then this is how he ended. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> This disturbs me because where's your body? <laughs> Clearly, it it's in the off. it's in the back of the <laughs> truck. I, you know, so, it's so funny. I don't even, I don't remember any. So I sent you this picture the next day, and you were like, "Wait, whose house is that at? Wh whose truck?" Who's and I was truck? like, "What? You really were gone by then?" <clears throat> I'm pleading the fifth. But it's tough because our friend has kids and we are all like bouncing off the walls, like annoying, I'm sure. And we're like, did we go inside? Was fun. We walk in, the kids come running over to us. Her husband has her father over and they're sitting in the, the living room just talking about football. Mm. And we're like, oh, this isn't good. <laughs> this, isn't, <laughs> this isn't gonna be good. I'm sure we put on a show for them. So then I'm like, you know what? Let's get out of here, Chris. Let's like, let's go to the office and have drinks. Cause why would we go home? Let's have more fucking drinks mm. and act even worse. Mm. So what do we do? We go down to the office. Yeah. And, and I think it's walking distance. Definitely not because I think Coco has a picture. Oh yeah. You ready for this one? <laughs> of how they? <laughs> you gonna kick me under the table? I'm totally <laughs> going to fuck you up. We have that. <laughs> <laughs> so <clears throat> that's how not... that's how the driver left your car. Yeah, yeah. But that's why it was so funny because we were laughing so hard because we were like. We came out, we're like, what the fuck happened yeah. to the car? Thank God when I went back the next day to get my car, it was not on the car <laughs> like that or towed away. No, because before we left, you actually moved it and straightened it up. Okay, see, I don't remember that either. Yeah. No, um, you were good. You yeah. were good. Yeah, but we got I hope to the I office. didn't, I hope my Uber driver didn't get an earful either. No, you're fine. I was just pissed you didn't have the keys. We went all the way I there. know. Apparently we sat on the stairs and talked we had, we about... We had a heart to heart. Oh, did we? Yeah. Oh. And then I, <laughs> I don't remember. And then I I'm got sure emotional. I'm sure it was amazing. I, got, I turned into an emotional fucking basket case and started crying. This is two weeks in a row. Like, I think I need to reel it in a little bit. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> no, I is. agree with you. You know what? Mm. I agree with you. Um, well, we're always going to have like a little sippy sip when we're here, you know? Yeah. But. Loosens up. Loosens, loosens up. up. Yeah. Yeah. However, we are coming into a certain time in our lives. We're coming, we're, we're getting up there in age and like our antics are a little bit. More is expected of us. More is expected of us. Cut no, the granted, shit. this is not. Cut the shit. Yeah. Cut the drama. No crying. Yeah, no, there's no crying in baseball. <laughs> no, no, like going down memory lane and being like, when I was a kid, this is what happened to me. Because apparently I did that too. And it was like, <laughs> that's why I say 50 shades of fucked up. I think I need therapy. A therapist. I need therapy. I you know, need, that's a good way. That's a good thing to segue into right now. Just because I like I talk to people now who like have therapists or life coaches. I think and I it's just it. like, maybe that's not a bad idea. I think I need it. So if you know of a good therapist, I don't care, man. Let or us woman, know. I might yeah. want to reach out to them because I think I need help. 
<laughs> again, and you First know, we step, kind of we I'm ca- admitting I have a problem. No. No, but 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 again, you know, we talked about this last week. You know, it's been a crazy year where we yeah. have not been able to like do anything and we're do anything animals. And I guess certain people will be like, you shouldn't be doing anything now. Fuck you. Well, we've um, all had it. All of us that hang out right. agree, agreed from the beginning. And I get tested every every two days. Yeah, just to make it. sure. Yeah. But we, we all agreed from the very beginning we would all hang out with the same crew. Mm-hmm. And if we, and we didn't, have. then we would get tested. And right. it's been that way, f- excuse me, since day one. Right. And and for everyone else who knows, like, I've literally been traveling all over the country, still producing television and stuff. So, like, I'm very on top of my testing and all of that other stuff. Anyway, that's that, not the point no. of this. What I was saying is, is that, like, you know... Uh, we haven't really been able to have those human interactions. So when we have them, it's just like, you know, it's like we're making up for like six months of not seeing each other or really we're ridiculous. Yeah. We are absolutely ridiculous. Yeah. But, but it you know does, what? Uh, it does make for great storytelling. It does. It does. It gives us content. So you're welcome. <laughs> you are welcome for my alcoholic inability mm. to hold my own. I don't mm-hmm. even know if that just made sense, but you know what? It made sense to me. But and I'm sure what? some of you guys out there understand what the fuck she's saying, right? Right. Yeah. You guys are so much fun. I don't know what you're talking about. So, <laughs> thank you. Coming we, from the peanut we think, gallery. We think we're fun, too. We yeah. really do. Well, she's serving us drinks half the time at the establishment she works at that I won't mention. Um, um, but can we talk about something else about getting like older? Who's getting older? The most important person. In, <laughs> the most important person in this room's birthday is coming up. Mm. I'm just kidding. Wait. No. <laughs> we both have birthdays. Two coming up. weeks away. But up, 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 but up, up, boom. I like cash donations. I like gifts. She's I gonna like be forty. Flowers. I like chocolate. I like toys. She's not gonna be forty. <laughs> no. <laughs> we did not even catch me saying that. Thirty. I didn't. I mean, thirty-nine. On Super Bowl Sunday, I Woo! can't wait. I love birthdays. If you know me, I fucking love birthdays. I can't wait for my birthday, and I'm gonna be in Florida. Oh. I don't even care if it's raining in seventy. I'm You're just gonna, not gonna be here. I'm not gonna be here, and right. I'm gonna see turquoise <laughs> water and green grass and palm trees, and it's gonna be heaven. And my man's I'm gonna so be happy cooking. For you. And and Scooter can cook. I will vouch for that. I mean, I don't know if he's quite on my level yet, but he's there. Oh, he's, he's close there. Yeah. Like, yeah. like I would I would compete with him. You know yeah. what I mean? Like, there's certain people I'm just like, I ain't competing. Which, please oh. get that shit out of here. Scooter, on the other hand, he's good. That boy can he can throw it out in the kitchen. So he can throw it out for sure. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Um, anyway, yeah, no. So yeah, we're, um, you know, it's kind of, it's all relative. We're kind of, we're getting older and, but the thing about it is, is it's like, I don't want to be like, oh, I'm getting old. So like, I'm just going to stop being fun. Like, I'm just, that's just never going to be me. You know, I don't have children. Um, I have a really fun career. Yeah. You know, I get to travel all over the place and I have really fun friends. So you got a hot man though. And I have a hot man. So. Shout out to you, boy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, so, yeah. Uh, so, th- I mean, there's been really good things about getting older, too. You know what I mean? Because there are, there are those moments where I do reel myself in. I know that we're sitting here and talking to you about our crazy nights, but it's literally, you caught us on two weeks where it has not been like this forever. Next week's going to be boring because I'm not leaving my house this week. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not kidding. Like, don't fucking call me. <laughs> don't. Nothing. I'm, I'm not listen, doing Listen, 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 listen. Linda. I'm, listen, Linda. <laughs> Uh, I'm with you on that. Like I'm, I'm all about having like a little quiet, little quiet. Um, you know, just stay home and think about <laughs> my bad decisions. <laughs> kind of weekend. I mean, and plus it's been a week too. I mean, you know, we got right in. We had, you know, we had some photo shoots and um, we did some show openings for some some new shows that are going to be popping on our platform soon. Um, so stay tuned for those. When did we get to see our photos? Like we did. Oh, we can talk to TT about that. Okay. Daddy TT. Yeah, um, Daddy. Shout daddy, out to Daddy. Daddy, he's in the other room. Daddy TT. Daddy TT be taking care of things. <laughs> but um, yeah, so it's, you know, we we work hard. 
and play hard. And we've always had that kind of mentality. You know, we're not just brats running around here. You know, we work very, very hard for and respectful. Our lifestyle. And, and res- we know and that there's a pandemic going on. We <clears throat> wear a mask. We, like I said, we hang out with the people we're supposed to. It's not about that. Yeah. So, no hate in there. And if you want to hang around with us, get a test. <laughs> and you can, can come chill with over. us yes god like let's get the freaking let's just be done with so this. your birthday's coming up and then right after that me? i'm getting you some truffle mac and cheese honey and oh, you're gonna yes, eat I it forgot. on this table like you said you I were forgot. going I to remember no, i said i need to be alone <laughs> you don't want anybody seeing you like Shovel. shoveling said, that food no, in your I mouth i told you last week i need to be my own okay, room fine but you told the audience that you would eat it on the table. I will. I will. I'll sample it. I okay. will sample it. No, you got to do it like you did in that picture. But what should we do for... And, oh, that's right. That's what led mm-hmm, us up to mm-hmm. What should we do for my birthday? You're going to be in Florida, bitch. No, I know. But obviously, you're not off the hook of celebrating it. So when no. we get back... But I mean, I think it's, you know, it's No, I just COVID. think when I get back, we should celebrate it together. Like yeah. yours and mine. Yeah. Like we can either go out to dinner with our I men. Really Maybe would. you guys should come to New York. Oh my God, that'd be so fun. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we could do that. Yeah. Um, I would love to go roller skating. Like I want to. Have... I see it all the time, and I'm just like, oh my god! Like, where? Are we, when are we going roller skating? I want to rent out a place and do like '80s theme, like crimp my hair, fry it even more, <laughs> 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 crimp my hair, put some like, I, what's those puff paint? Make puff paint shirts, tie them on the side, like three socks that are layered up my shins, and some crazy skates, and just have a skate night. I'm Just with it. Just for my friend. I'm but with it. Where do you fucking do that? I don't know. If you guys know, like, tell us where we can go we and have, like, go a little skate. I mean, are, pl- are places like that even open right now? There used to be one in Groton, but it's closed. Mm. It sucks. Mm. I remember back in the day, like, <clears throat> Norwich, Connecticut had grade skate. And I remember going there. And then, you know, I grew up in the uh, Canterbury area, so we used to go to Skate Inn. Yeah, I never went there. But do you remember Skate Nights? Mm-hmm. Like, like all night skates. Yes. And yeah. you would be like, oh my God, I'm going to, oh my God. I remember, I think I have this. My mom gave me this big um, Tupperware thing of all my notes that I hid <laughs> under that my bed. That you like wrapped up and no, like folded. The, the, yeah. The triangle. The, the triangle. Yeah. Oh yeah. They're all like oh, yeah. that. Oh and yeah. And I'm reading them one day and <laughs> literally one of them's like, will you skate with me at skate night in circle yes or no? Do you like me yes or no? Can I kiss you? Yes or no. Can I French kiss you? Ooh. And I'm like, oh my God. And like, and I remember my parents dropping me off and my palms were sweaty and I'm like, this is it. I'm going to have my first kiss tonight. Oh my God. And I did. And I was so stupid. I did kissed you, him. Did you slip the tongue? No, I kissed him and ran away. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> I was so scared. My have things changed. <laughs> I know. Now I'm like. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Wait, do that again. No. <laughs> Come on, please. <laughs> <clears throat> um, that's so cute. That yeah. is so cute to know that to, to think like little Katie Allen was like shy at one point. Yeah, I'm going to bring in a picture because. I have literally the picture I'm thinking of. <laughs> it's a black shirt with puff paint. And my mom, okay, mind you. I That's have, the 90s, not the 80s, by the way. Right, but I have a side ponytail. Ooh. That's crimped. And then a fluorescent, like, blue headband on. Oh, we need to see that picture. With laser beam background, remember? The laser beams. beams. Laser beams. <laughs> and I remember skate night was that night. And that was the outfit that I had my first kiss in. Oh, I remember it all. So cute. What was your first kiss? Was it like sensual and amazing? If it was, I hate you. No, <clears throat> it was on the side of somebody's <laughs> house. It was a girl too. Um, she was in her bedroom window, and me and like two of my friends were like outside of her window because we like snuck and over it was to her like house. A Shakespeare like. It was kind of like that, <clears throat> and the, and if she's watching, you know exactly who this is. I think I know who it is. No, you don't. No? no, is it somebody's sister? No, that was she wasn't my first kiss. Oh, okay. Yeah, Keep she going. was like after. Continue then. Yeah, my first kiss I was like in fifth grade or something. Okay. Yeah, Listen, I, was a, I was a pimp back then. So, um, but anyway, yeah. So that was that was my first kiss. Okay. Mm-hmm. And was it good? Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> Were you like, oh, I like guys? <laughs> no, no, it was no. She didn't. Was she? Tell me more. Give me the juice. No, that's scoop. all you get. Was that's, there tongue? 
Yeah, there was time. It was sloppy. Oh my god, do you remember? I was just gonna say, do you remember that person that sloppy kissed you, and you would you 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 pull away, and you'd be like, oh my god. See, I th- have there's a your certain mouth on my face. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yes, there's that, but then there's a certain amount of sloppy kiss that I do like. There's a certain amount of like wetness and in the moment, yes, and, and noises for sure. that I like. Noise that, why noise. You, <laughs> noises, noises, noises. <laughs> um, but yeah, my first kiss was you know it was sloppy and. I was like, ooh, a tongue in my mouth. Yeah. I fucking did it. (laughs) And it was a girl. What? (laughs) To all you motherfuckers who said I was gay, I am. (laughs) (laughs) But I still kissed your girl. (laughs) Um, But uh, yeah, but just to go back for a full circle, I would love to have like a skate night. I think that yeah. would be so cool. And I was like the shit back then. I could skate backwards. Shoot and, like, the duck. Spin. Remember shoot the I duck? Couldn't, I can't shoot the duck. I think I have, my legs are too long. So I can't squat down the way other people do and have like the same balance. I just, it just never worked for me. So. I was good at it. I think maybe because I'm short, but now I think my ass is too big. I would probably <laughs> topple. <laughs> I would probably topple over. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, who know? I mean, I'm like worried about like breaking a kneecap now and like a hip and shit. We're I know, so right? Old. And because we, you know, obviously we have to work. So how are we gonna go? You're gonna come in with a cane mm-hmm. to do this? I mean, I would love it. Pimp it out. I know. So I, I think I we would, should do that. I think we should work on that. Finding yeah. a place to roller skate, and we'll have a theme. We'll have a theme, and we'll yes. just go do it. And I want like you know. 90s, 80s and 90s yeah. music playing. Like yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna say 80s. I think 80s and 90s is our bag. You know what I mean? Like some Madonna, some Michael Jackson, but then throw in Janet, some like, yeah, and, Janet. And, and then like, like some Nelly. Pearl Jam. Yes. You know yes. what I mean? Oh my God. Yeah. We have to do this. We have to do it. Let's make it fucking happen. Okay. Who wants to come to the party? Let us know. We're fine. You can't come though. It's COVID. Okay. <laughs> oh yeah. I forgot. Um, do you ever get any like shitty gifts for your birthday that you're like, I think I'm going to re-gift this? Yeah. I get a shitty gift every year. It's called nothing. <laughs> that is not true. No, that's not true. Your parents, you're living in LA and they're, you're like, I'm coming home for my birthday and that was your present. And that's a great present. Right. But I also, I was also, it was also my, the premiere for my film, which is why I flew all the way home. This is true. Yeah. This but is true. No, my parents are awesome. Like best people in the world. Shout out to Nuffy and Ernie. I love you. They are great. <laughs> um, and and your dad's great too. My mom's great too. I know, but I haven't met your mom. I wish I don't even know what your mom looks like. <clears throat> Can you believe we've been friends for so long and I don't really know what your mom looks like? Really? Like I saw like a picture of you when you guys were really little. Yeah. But like you know, I've never seen like a recent picture of your mom. I'll have to have her down here one day to listen to this. She'll die in the corner. Yeah. She'll yeah. be like, oh my god, Katie. But your dad, I see all the time. Yeah. You know what I mean? He's a social butterfly. Yeah. So he's like. You guys want to do shots? And I'm like, no, I got to go to bed. It's 10 o'clock. Wait, your dad was at the party. He, what party? At least. At, oh, the, last weekend? Yeah. Or two weekends ago? Yeah, he mm. came in. Yeah, I barely mm. remember that. I don't I remember saying goodbye remember to that. Too. That's why it's like, I can't. I can't. Yikes. I fucking can't. Um, what were we talking about, though? Regifting. Oh, yes. Um, stop beeping. <laughs> <laughs> um, your you know, beeping. here's the deal. Like. I don't expect anything from people. So, you know, if people want to go out of their way to present me with a gift on my birthday, I'm going to be appreciative. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for something yeah. I can re gift later. <laughs> I'm kidding. No, but re gifting is the worst because, like, I found some stuff when Scooter moved in in the closet that I don't think I had opened ever. From years ago, and I was like, "Shit, I would love to regift this, but what if I gift it to the to fucking person that gave it to me?" Because you got to keep the tag on a girl. Like, if there the was like a from or like a to or from, it was a box. But it didn't say like "Happy Birthday, Katie" from blah blah blah. No, it didn't say that. It said oh. "Happy Marriage." <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> you know what? You can regift all of that shit. I'm sure it's fine. That's why it's been sitting in the box. No. <laughs> yeah, uh-huh. but I was, yeah, but uh, no, I was just like, what do I fucking like? What do I do? Like, it's <clears throat> I don't know. I have to move closer. Yeah, a little bit. Okay, I can't hear you. Okay, I can hear you now. Um, but yeah. I, I can't, I can't, I can't. I'm not a good re-gifter. I'm not. 
Not. Move your chair up, girl. Okay. Okay. You want me to like sit on top of the mic? Like that, Coco? Does she sound good? Yeah. Is she good? Yes. Get on right. top of that mic, girl. Yes. yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm like eyeing this mic. chicken. I'm just like, I really want to have another piece, but I this. <laughs> I don't want to be chewing and, you know, we're really in a flow right now. So, so not... eat. I mean, I can, I can go. I can continue. Okay, good. You eat. She's going to talk and I'm going to eat. You eat. Um, Coco, were you able to get those videos? No, right? That I sent you? No. That's totally fine. So I have this situation mm. that it frustrates me and I don't understand. I have, I have to know this. Why is it when guys get sick, it is the end of the world? Mm. It, it's like you could have COVID. Let's talk, well, I don't even want to talk about COVID. I'm so sick of talking yeah. about COVID. But you have the flu, the normal fucking flu. Look, and, AIDS. And you're, <laughs> no. you're dying. Like you're literally like, and you're on your deathbed, but. You're still doing laundry and cleaning, and oh, you're going for the ranch. Oh, I'm going for the ranch, girl. Mm -hmm. Mm. (laughs) Got a little ranch in my finger. Lick it. (laughs) (laughs) But you go in, and like, I I still have laundry to do. I still have to grocery shop. I still have to vacuum. But a guy gets sick, and it's like, uh, can't move. Not all guys are like that. Bitch, please. <laughs> but I do yes. know, yes, a lot of guys are. They, they guys are pussies a little bit. Big pussies with little fucking dicks. <laughs> <laughs> Again, she's talking about nobody in this room. <laughs> no, but um, you, I don't know. That, I mean, are you that I, person. No, I mean, yeah, right. I probably have my moments, but most of the time, if I'm the one, if I'm like. If I'm complaining and stuff, it's because I just want people to leave me the fuck alone. So, yeah. like, when I start bitching and complaining, it's just, like, people are going to stop bothering me and just let me be. Let me be sick. Let me take care. Because here's the deal. It's just, like, I'm always, like, I know how to take care of somebody who is sick. So yeah. I know how to take care of myself when I'm sick. I know what the fuck I need to do. You know what I mean? I whip out the chicken soup and the broth and I add my... I'm not going to actually give people what I do because I don't don't want you to get the remedy. I'm not like all about cooking. I'm like, I literally feel like I'm dying, but I, I'm the type of person where, and Scooter knows this. He pointed it out the other night when I'm not feeling well, I just want to, I literally just want to crawl in my bed, Mm -hmm. die. I don't want, I don't, I won't text you back. I won't call you. I won't do anything. Mm -hmm. Let me die. And then. I'll come out of my hole. Right. And it'll be fine. It'll be fine. And I'll be great. You'll be great. And you'll get laid. (laughs) But you gotta let me be in my hole. And you'll have a clean house and you'll have a grocery, I mean, a fridge full of uh, groceries and life will be great. But when you say like guys are, are, are bitches like what do you like what specifically i don't mean are guys are bitches about? no 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 i like when they're yeah. sick you know what i mean like what specifically is it that it's just, just like, it's ah! like they die i don't know it's like you all i don't know i can't say you all because i don't get in trouble for saying that i mean like like i feel like god you don't know what i'm you don't agree with no me. I, I i do i do know what you're saying i just want the listeners to hear you know somebody know might learn it. something about themselves i don't know how to explain it i just think when guys get sick they are fucking babies that's it like everything that's is it. a problem that's everything it. you get a paper cut and it's like i need to go to the hospital to get sick. <laughs> 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 we got coco's coco's got something to say to me hold on oh Mm. Um, so Oh Ew. Hey I don't Coco. know if you guys have heard But have you heard like the latest biggest scandal Scandal Yeah in, like pop culture and Hollywood. Oh my god I'm ready Pop culture Yeah. No, I thought you were talking about a mystic I was like yes I did hear the latest drama <laughs> <laughs> You missed that one That one right over your head Go I did. ahead Sorry. Go ahead Ready Oh we're playing it Go ahead Oh, oh no I'm just gonna give you Wait, is that is that Army Hammer? Yes. So I heard a little bit about what the fuck is going on. So he What's wanted to like on? eat her or something, like chop parts of her and like grill it and eat it. What? 
So yeah. This per- this girl in particular, her name was Paige Lorenz. Mm-hmm. He was his. She was his ex girlfriend mm-hmm. um, for four months, and she left the relationship with like PTSD, and she was like deeply traumatized because they would have like kinky sex games that would get out of control. Did he like have a fork and a knife with him? <laughs> um, so wait, but where did it get to the creepy? Like where? Okay. So she said that they would play these kinky sex games that would get out of control, and that one day he took a knife to her groin area and carved her pussy. Yeah, and carved an A. He fucking carved an A in her vagina. Okay. Yes. Okay. Wait a second. And she couldn't get away. <clears throat> so that's not even the worst part. He carves the A into her groin and licks vagina. the blood. And licks the blood. Yes. Don't you know you can get diseases, Army? Like, but why? He's so hot. I know. So the other thing that I heard what? too, like he was, um, he was what contracted to play in the next J Lo movie and got removed because of this scandal. Is that correct? Yeah. yeah. He's like the new. He's like the next Night Stalker. Hannibal Lecter. No Night Stalker. Well, Hannibal Lecter used to eat well, his yes. victims. Yeah. But that's <laughs> fucking disgusting. Yeah. Is she okay? So she, she looks fine. <laughs> I mean, she does. Look at that picture. She's beautiful. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully somebody gave her some like vaginal reconstruction surgery that the A is gone. Nope. But what's crazy is... Is there a picture of the A? Right on. Oh. That he... looks like a belly button. <laughs> <laughs> no, it definitely looks like he carved a little something. Oh, no, he her. did. Okay, I can't see. Yes. Oh, my God. Ew. So the crazy thing is, it's not just her. Like, at least eight women have come forward, like, with multiple, like, similar, similar stories, like, bite marks, teeth So marks. I want to say this lightly. No, say it heavily. Fuck that. I want to say, I don't know how to say this politically correct, but it looks like if somebody's coming at you with a knife or somebody has some sharp object down there, and they touch you one time with it. Wouldn't you run away, walk away, push away? No. You're going to no. let... Because some bitches are like, I'm going to let you do some things. That's and then I'm going to let it come back and bite you in the ass later. Like, no. Absolutely fucking I'm not. not saying she did. I'm just saying like some girls will take a, a certain amount of things and then cash in on it later. Especially when it's Hollywood. I'm just saying. So she's 22. He's 34. Ugh. Oh, God. But... There were like some text messages that were like submitted and mm-hmm. like report like what are what, Do you have what those? Media? Yeah. Let's so see these. Says, from um, her to him or him to well, both. Him to sure. her. Oh, it him says, him. I'm so hard thinking of holding your heart in my hands and controlling it when it beats. I am one hundred percent a cannibal. I want to eat you. Fuck. That's scary to admit, B. I've never admitted that before. I've cut the heart out of a living animal before and eaten it while still warm. So my question to you guys is, <laughs> how far do you let BDSM get? Uh, uh, you can choke me a little bit. I'm going like, to let you answer this one. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're both going to answer this, because but hold on. I'm, I will say. I'm still like, what the flying fuck? Um, nobody's coming at me with no motherfucking knife. First of all, like, let's just make that oh. clear. Well, first, like, first off, hopefully she's okay. And yes. hopefully he's in jail and in some straight jacket and deep therapy. Well, he's definitely being blacklisted from Hollywood right now. So that's, that's the beginning phases. I mean, that's the fucking beginning phase. Like well, he's not yeah. in jail. That I mean, this is, this is pretty, phase. this is pretty new news. Like yeah. it just came out like whether or like a week ago or something, it took forever to get Harvey Weinstein arrested. And he like raped a bunch of women, and you know what I mean. Oh, I'm just just totally <clears throat> disturbed. Okay, so go back to allegedly, this. allegedly, I'm allegedly. Disturbed? No, no, no. Oh, I'm yeah. like, what? Yes. No, I really am. Go ahead, you you, you answer. Uh, BD, like, mm, I'm again, I'm I'm not really with it. Again, like a little bit of choking's fine. Um, I am some slapping around. I agree. A bit. I'm all for like choking. I don't want to tap out. I I, I can't. It's no, not, this that's is not, not like the fun. WWE. I'm not like <laughs> tapping out over here. Like a cute red look to my face. Is yeah, cute. yeah. Purple, 
Blue, not a good look for me, okay? I want you so, to think that I'm joking, but I don't want to actually really be joking. Yes, maybe you know? actually. I can act like I'm joking, trust me. I can make the noises and everything. Throw in a couple like... <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The- Along with the... <laughs> uh, uh, you know what I mean? Like it's, I mean, it's got to be a little that, bit of both. Sounds, that sounds very boring. Uh, well, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, like maybe. a little moaning with the choking is oh. good. But like <laughs> if you're really choking me, you're not going to get a moan. You're going to get like, <laughs> like that's not cool. So. Yeah. And <laughs> I'm not for like the whole mask beat like ball gag thing. Like, I no. Don't, how does Ugh. a ball gag exactly turn somebody on? Listen, if it's not on your body, I don't want it in my mouth. I will say that um, there is this table that I want. <laughs> <laughs> Do we have a picture of this table? Can you send it? I send do. it to send it to Coco, please. I do. I do. I Before do. you finish this story, we need to be able to pull up this table that you're talking about. I do, but there's this table that I want to buy, and um, it's it's, <laughs> it's hold on, I don't know how to find it. No, I, I can't stop laughing because I just have all of these different visions of you on a table. Oh. You're gonna go crazy. <laughs> How does Scooter think about this table? Did you tell He's him? like, buy it. Ooh. Here it is. Um, so of then course I have he did. to take this and I, oh my god. She's Can you send that? Me. She's mm-hmm. not allowed near granite though. No granite for you. It's so fucking cold. It's the worst. <laughs> no, so I found this sex table on Etsy and um I really wanna get it. And I'm not sure how I would use it. I mean, obviously I know how I'd use it, but like I think it'd be fun and I think it'd be adventurous and maybe I just got my fucking Valentine's Day idea. Um, Scooter's getting you that, not me. I didn't mean for you, you oh, okay. idiot. I meant- <laughs> oh, wait, I was thinking your birthday. I'm sorry. Yes, yeah, Valentine's no. Day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, uh-huh. I mean, and I mean like, idiot. idiot. <laughs> no. You fucking moron. Maybe I figured out my Valentine's Day idea. I'll get him. Where are you going to put that? I also this I want you know my top floor. <laughs> I knew you were gonna say that. I want it to be like that movie Fifty Shades of Grey. I want a red room. I do. So like you own the place, make it your red room. No, I could, but I painted it green. I'm just kidding. <laughs> so now you have a green room. No, I'm kidding. No, I know it has nothing to do with it being red. But I want to have a red room. But I just feel like I need like I need somebody to come in there and design it. Because I need to know like where what goes in there. I'm gonna have this table in the center of the room and nothing else. So if there's anybody out there who is a designer that can design <laughs> Katie's sexy red room in her top floor, hit us up. Coco, Let did you find know. it? Uh, how do you send it to uh... Okay. It's fine. If it, it's fine if it won't come through. No, she's gotta see this table. Yeah. Sorry. It's great. And it, it's, I don't know, I think it's like six, seven hundred dollars. But um, I'll segue. <laughs> I'll segue into this. Um, at the beginning of this, we were talking with Coco and she was telling us about a sugar daddy. And mm. not to throw you in on it, but I want to know more about this fucking sugar daddy. And what did he do? So he was a doctor and um, we were seeing each other for like. Months. Why did you have a sugar daddy? Just because. Why did I? My Because why not? She wanted one. Well, my friend had one, and she was like making two grand off of this guy. But where do you go to find one? Is it just like you look in the? Basically, I was gonna no. say the phone book. Oh my god. There's little dating sites. <laughs> 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 but um, yeah, so she was making two grand a month. What, what is she doing? So is it like a job? Are you an escort? Are you fucking them? Do you have to like literally? No. So I actually ended up liking my sugar daddy. Yeah. <laughs> so so just can okay. We, can we pull a chair up for you? Yeah, I know, right? Um, wait, she how old was mic. he? How old was he? You can say what, like forties, fifties, sixties, seventies. He was in his late thirties. Oh, that's not a sugar that daddy. That is not a sugar daddy. Well, I was. Okay, okay, I understand, like, okay, so there's an age gap there, totally fine, but to me, I think Sugar Daddy, I'm like... 40 and up. Yeah, 50 and up. 
Well, because we're almost 40, so. Yeah, that's why I'm like 65. <laughs> <laughs> she going for sugar granddaddies. <laughs> I'm having a cat. Wait, is that a thing? That sounds like a category. Sugar granddaddies. Sugar granddaddies. <laughs> yeah. It I, might be. I ended up finding out he was married because. Duh. He, I, well, you know what? I was young and naive. I went to his house and there was a family photo and I was like. And I looked around and I was like, oh, my God. <clears throat> he was like, see, you didn't know what you were getting into? Like, was there kids involved? A little finger painting hand. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my God. I was like, Those were his grandkids. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait. No, he was in the 30s, um, right? Oh, my yeah. God. Oh, yeah. my God, Coco. Yeah. Not my so what would you do? Obviously end it? Yeah. I immediately was like, my Fuck stomach you. started turning, and I was like, "You're a piece of shit." How much money did you make though? Hmm. Well, How much? Come on, you can tell us. I mean, it ballpark. Was more like treat show sales, you know. It was never like. Okay, okay. okay so go shopping. I get yeah. you. I get you. I get you. Okay. Okay. Was the sex good? Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. How was that, dick? Oh. He taught me so much. I bet he well, did. Again, so you got but a you lot. Uh, you got something out of it. You had everything to learn. Exactly. Yeah. Everything to learn. Well, and I mean, he clearly learned nothing. You remember having sex when you were nineteen? You're like, oh, I'm so good. I didn't and have did sex when I was nineteen. <laughs> I was a virgin. I think I remember. Are you serious? No. <laughs> I was a I was a guy virgin. Like I hadn't been with a man yet. But sex, like you had sex. Yeah, that's what you want to call it. Mm. Okay. Okay. But I kind of want more information. Yeah, and we'll save that for another episode <laughs> of Why? Totally Inappropriate. No. <laughs> because that's a long story. And I don't okay, really fine, 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 fine. But back to the sugar daddy thing. Like, I, 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 I can't do it. But you've had so, lots of offers. So many offers and so many people. And, like, people wanted to, like, fly you, like, around the world. Yes. And yeah. And give me my allowance would be ten thousand. Remember, I saved <laughs> yes, ten thousand dollars a month, and I had. I almost told her to fucking do it and split like, it with me. It, yeah, and I was like, "What is wrong with you?" Then this other guy was like, "Can you send me your panties and I'll pay you like five grand?" And he's like, "I will fucking rub that all over my ball sack and you can send it to him and give me half the money." And I'm Fuck like, "Okay, sorry, like, like fine, yeah. fine, no." But I just, I've never understood. We have a friend, a mutual friend that we think is a escort. And nobody's been able to call um, that person out. I won't say male or female. But it is. Wait. (laughs) It is um, just somebody. It just doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. And I have to approach this lightly. I can't say too much of why I think so because I'm sure that person is watching this. So, and I don't want to, I don't want to piss anybody off. But I'm pretty sure one of our friends is an escort. I just so. need a little more sips. If there's this, if there's a site that you know of, let me know so I can look her up to see if she's on it. <laughs> <laughs> I think they got rid of like Backpage and shit. The back door wasn't it called like the back door? Backpage. Back, it was Backpage. Mm-hmm. This girl that used to come into the bar all the time. Not that I was ever on that set or anything, but. No, this girl that I that used to come into the bar all the time, she was a fucking hot mess. Her and her boyfriend used to park their Winnebago outside of Rosie's kids. <laughs> <laughs> Good old Rosie's. Rosie's. Yeah. And they would um bring the strippers from there out and create content in their Winnebago. Oh. <laughs> And then she would come into the Smokies. It's like redneck be, porn. She would be so proud of herself. She'd be like, Kate, look at this scene I did this week. What do you think I should do with it? And I'm like. Throw it in the trash. The <laughs> why am I your mentor? Like, I don't. More, more importantly, why are you coming to me with this? <laughs> was it. I mean, what did it look like, though? Was it good? It was. It was. Sloppy. Drunk. Mm. Drugged sex. Like, just like a debauchery. Yeah. I mean, I would expect that from Rose's Cantina. Yeah. Do you know I used to... I can't really... And it wasn't even in Rose's Cantina. Apparently, it was in the parking lot in Winnebago. Yeah. I used to go there when I was younger. Much, much, much younger. And (laughs) do mind mind erasers. Remember mind erasers? Oh, my God. Yes. When I was like 20... So, like, mind erasers were like... But they're so good. They were so good, but I get so fucked up. So, I was living in Key West where... 
um, that's where we were doing those all the fucking time. Yeah. I was working at this resort down there. I never knew that. that yeah, you worked in that or at a resort? Yeah. Okay, go ahead. Mm-hmm. Keep telling me. We'll talk about that too. I got some stories for days from back then. Tell me. But again, you know, I was 23 at the time. And uh, yeah, so Mind Erasers. Yeah. Like 23, 24. And they were like, for those of you who don't know, it's it's a short glass, like a mm-hmm, rocks glass. Mm-hmm. And it's Kahlua, Stoli Vanilla, or Vanilla Vodka, and then Club Soda. And you take a straw and you suck it down as fast as you can. So you get the Kahlua at the very bottom and it literally tastes like chocolate. It's mm-hmm. so good. It's really, you should bring there that was back. A, oh no. And then there was Jaeger bombs. That was Ew. the other thing. No. So we Jaeger? used to do mind erasers. Yeah. And then when I came back up north after my stint down in Florida, everyone was doing Jaeger bombs up here. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then a couple years ago, um, jump 20 years. <laughs> Um, duck farts came into play. I don't know what the fuck that is. Yes, you do. We've done 300 of them. All right. You're going to have to remind me. It's Crown, Kahlua, and Bailey's, but it's so fucking good. Oh, yeah. It's like, you know, I just love it. We we roll be out at a bar or a club back when we could go to clubs or when we used to go to clubs and we'd be like, it'd be so loud. And they're like, what do you want? And you're, they're like, can I get 10 duck farts? They're like, what? (laughs) 10 duck farts. (laughs) Everybody's looking at you like, the fuck are you ordering? <laughs> They're so good. I it's promise. like, bitch, get with the program. Equal parts, try it. Amazing. Tell them, tell them what's in it again. Crown, Kahlua, and Bailey's. Mm-hmm. How mm-hmm. many of those do you have to have in order to do something? One, two. Oh, is that the table? That's the sex table. <laughs> so wait, so, I'm so I can't look. Can we get that on full it. screen? So you must. Okay, 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 okay. So look, you can put your knees there. You, you can go on your stomach. You can probably go on your back. Mm. I don't really know, but I think experimenting is. All Does it come well. with like an instruction manual? <laughs> 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 Are there straps on that thing? There is. Can we get? Can I just need the full screen a little bit longer? I'm sorry. Longer? Yeah, just a little bit longer. I just want to kind of. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, so oh, the, there's straps like moves in the down. wall. It's, oh, and it moves up and down. I don't think the Etsy builder comes. It provides an instruction manual. Are they talking about the background? <laughs> in, his, in his garage, then he put a carpet down. He's like, let me showcase this. I want to put this Wait, carpet. so somebody somebody privately made that? Yeah, it's on Etsy. Et- and he's selling it on Etsy? Yeah. Well, I didn't know where else to look up sex tables, so I was like, let me start at Etsy because they right. make everything. So you should message him and be like, hey, so can I have that? Or can you build me one? And what does that look like? No, he will. They, he's selling them. Oh. It's like five hundred bucks, five six hundred bucks. But I'm, I want. I think I could be lowballing it, but I want to try it. Happy Valentine's Day to Scooter. you, Scooter. Get yourself. She'll have you strapped up in that <laughs> fucking thing, Scooter. You better be careful. I'm gonna lock you up. And say, I'm, gonna go, I'm going shopping. She going shopping. No, I would tie him up though. That would be fun. It would be fun. I want to see pictures. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Scooter, you know, I'm just saying. I, I just thought it would be funny to see you guys like. You look at his ass all the fucking time. He's got a nice ass. He, get, he does not. He's oh got my a God. small booty. She shits on her man's ass so much. It's small, but it's a booty. He doesn't have like a flat butt. No, he doesn't have a And he wears butt. very accentuating pants so it's hard to yes. not look like i it's just like you know when a guy sees a girl's ass like so what he stares at it i'm a dude and i stare at it like i look at his butt you should be happy i look at his butt do you stare at other women's asses if they're big? you do yeah you do i was gonna say don't Why be coming up here in line <laughs> she's like keep your mouth shut coco no coco you talk whenever you want no, to no, no. we gonna get coco a mic for the next show seriously. i think right seriously right she's, you know howard stern what's the girl's name in it robin she's our robin mm-hmm. yeah coco we got you girl so i think we're out of time are we i don't want to be over. i know it's like now it's time to say goodbye from what's that song? From all our friends, all in our here. company. M I C. See you real soon. K E Y. Why? Because we love you. See you next fucking Tuesday. See you next fucking Tuesday for Taste- another episode of Tastefully Inappropriate. Inappropriate. With yours truly. Mwah. Ciao. Peace.